I, I'm sorry for being a bad host, Naki. I, I need to go lie down. My head is killing me. You've done nothing but show me kindness. Go rest. I'll be okay. Later that night. Well, what was that? Uh, lover? Well, at least you're friends. That's good, right? I, I don't know. It still doesn't feel right. Maybe it would be less awkward if you two were to get to know each other a little bit more. Do you even know how dangerous getting to know me is? Do you really want that risk? I sure as hell don't. <laughs> oh, <clears throat> oh, God, Doc. You let her get away. She was so nervous. And <clears throat> you should have said something. She's a once-in-a-lifetime girl. Are you going to let that go? Are you even going to set up a second date? She was crying. Do you honestly think she'd want a second date? The first one made her cry. I never should have done it. I should have just left the flowers and never looked back. Maybe it's a good idea. If you try to go comfort her, Doctor, give her a hug. Try and help her out a bit. Don't leave Laura like that, even if you are just a friend to her. Be the best friend she ever had. Don't let her up. Don't. Don't leave her upset, mad, or anything else negative. Hold her until she's happy again and comfort her. I, you're right. Should at least give her that. All I've ever done is run away from her. So, I'll try to do this one right, one thing right. Well, wish me luck. I think I'm going to need it. Doctor Pain. Mom, help. No, he is fire. Lies. Lyra? Mom, come home. Oh, lips. Oh, wait. I think that's. Uh, I think that was him, maybe? No, it's the two phone. It's the... Well, the who all lives here? Oh. I don't know. Who all lives here? Oh, it's just me, myself, and I now. She's... I wonder how long has she been alone here? She's more like me, but... But... Miss Donkey, I think you might need to return the favor of kindness to Miss Laura. I think she needs a friendly ear and a good presence, such as yours right now, Naki. I know you may have protested this, but what Laura needs now is a hug. I do it, but reasons. So go on and hug the lass. Akashi, I think Laura needs a friend right now. Hey, Naki, I know you just met her, but Laura is feeling kind of down right now, so maybe you should try to comfort her. <laughs> I'm sorry, did I wake you up, Laura? Uh, Help him stop. Laura, are you okay? Laura? Yeah, Tex is kind of small on this one. Yeah, we can skip it, I guess. Yeah. Dark. Alone, um, lies, kiss. Lara, hey, wake up! Lara! Lies, he let them die. All his fault. Murder. Exterminate. No, it it's not all his fault. He's just lost. Please. Please make it stop. I'm sorry, doctor. Lara, please wake up! Ah, hey! What the? 
the hell? Um. You stay back. Wait, it's all right. I'm the doctor. What's going on? You on Rose's band song and doctor, then that means you can help her. She won't wake up. She's stuck. I I don't know if I run coward. Please, I don't know what to do. All right. Let me see. Oh, the last. What are you doing? I'm going to reach into her mind. Oh, that's familiar. <laughs> the mind but has many doorways, that? and I need to find the right one. Do we want to jump through these? Yeah, I'll do the second page. Okay. Well, then, since we can't see what's happening out here, we are going with the doctor into your head. Hopefully, the doc can save you from your nightmare. What kind of sick, twisted things are we going to find? Are we going to see in your mind? Please, don't let fear control you, Laura. You need to get out of that nightmare. Laura, don't be upset. I, I love you. A O A L. Now, to find the right door. Happy birthday, me. <laughs> Again. So many of her alone. Hmm. hmm. Must be careful what you touch, Doctor. The wires of the brain are fragile. Miss Naki. Please take notice of the eerie green beam of light coming through the window that are on Miss Laura. What's going on above the house? Whoa, what the- You! You were a horrible man. You carried in a little blue box. But it wasn't all your fault. You had to do some of the things you did. I- I loved you so much. I could see that under all the darkness. Was someone as lonely and as frightened as I am. Someone like me. I'm a fool to think I could just walk in and be able to help you. What, what is this? Vassalon, don't blink. Genocide, Dr. Daleks, exterminate. Pandorica, Time Lord. The last. How? This is impossible. This is... Lonely angel. Destruction. Time vortex. Lies. Run. Space. Silence. No. Leave the room. Uh, okay. There's no doubt this is from a modified Cyberman info stack. Laura. Laura, can you hear me? Why isn't it working? There's only one way. Oh, master, you bastard. I'm so sorry. You have to forget. So, so sorry. Prince Charming to the rescue! Now would be the time to kiss the good doctor. Pong. Hello, Goofy. That's creepy. Flick. <laughs> Seeds like this have been planted everywhere. Everyone you've met, everyone you've seen, everyone you love. You don't know who I've affected. Just remember, no matter where you are, no matter when you are, I will find you. You are not safe. You are never, you will never be safe from me. 
I'm going to pick you apart. I'm going to break you. And when this is all over, you will remember your place. Mm. Uh, interesting. Uh, there we go. Is Laura going to be okay? Is Laura okay? Is Laura going to be okay? Nightmare. Um, what happened? Is she back to normal? Doctor, you should check. Is Laura going to be safe? It's gone now. She she'll be all right. Doctor. What the hell happens? It's dealt with. She's going to be fine. Get your dear Laura back into the house of her friend. Doctor, there's nothing else you can do. You're her friend, yes? And I need you to listen very carefully. She won't remember me and never should. Don't ever mention anything about me. And protect her from those who might try. If she remembers me at all, everything will rush back and she'll be lost forever. This is too sad, Doc. Laura has been hurt enough. You know what? <clears throat> you know what you have to do, as Carly as it may be? Goodbye. So, how are you going to solve this? Huh? Run before anything bad happens to you. Run. It always ends this way. Is the master's control gone now? What exactly did he do to her? It's gone. He planted an emergency protocol in the info stamp, knowing I would deactivate it. When I did that, it presented the, that final message through her. Doctor, I think, <clears throat> I think the only thing, okay, that can be done is now to leave Laura B for forever. It seems it must ache you having to do this, but as I previously stated, it's the only thing that can be done. You're right. That's what you get, Doctor. You shouldn't have involved in mare like Laura. I think it is better that you didn't see her again or cause her pain by just being around you. It always ends this way. I'm sorry. You did what you had to. You did the right thing. Story of my lives. Doctor, how's Laura doing? And you do... <coughs> and you... And do you have any plans to get back to the master? Get back to the master for this? I don't know, I can read. Mm. No more. Doctor, you're gonna have to stand up to the master, like now. He is ruining your life. We all will support and help you. Hell, I'll die if needed to. If needed to, put that bastard in his place. You read right now. That's it, man. Game over. The only way it out is clear. You must make the master see why he should fuck off. Make him see that you are done with this, with his shit. Don't give him any of that coward BS too. I know you know that this is the only way. Are you gonna take that crap from the master? Screwing with your loved ones. Stand up to him. I know it's hard, but you'll have to eventually. You said Laura must forget, but will that really protect her from the master? Even if the device is broken, there's only one way, the gun. You must put that bastard six feet under, or everything you have and will ever, ever will ha has, has doomed. <sighs> actually, she does have a gun. Come on, Doctor. Ten end it. The Master has been terrorizing the people. You love law for too long. You still have the gun that DRD gave you. Finish him. Time for you to get pissed. The Master has gone too far again. 
And this regeneration, you're supposed to be crazy and cynical, right? Well, use that to hunt down the master and kill him. Come on, man. Tom's Weston. Someone is due for an appointment with the doctor. Doctor, you are going to have to stand up to the master. Like now, he's ruining your life. We'll support you and help you. Hell, um, I died. Oh, did I do this? You already, do you think you restarted the same thing? Oh, uh, sorry. The thing jumped up for some reason. So, doctor, are you planning to put a bullet through his head or heart? Gonna make him suffer or you're gonna make it, gonna, going to make it quick? Right through the head, I won't take chances. Yeah, because with the heart, you need to shoot him twice. <laughs> Can't do this. If you do, you're just as bad as the master. There's always another way. There has to be. Go ahead, duck. Come the master. Become like him. I'll solve your problems. No, I'm nothing like him. You know why? Because the one thing he's never done is try to kill me. Hmm. Eh. Why use the gun, Doctor? Why not torture him, make him suffer? Like he has done to you, remember? It's just, he's hurt so many, he's hurt Marshmallow. Wait! Why kill the Master when you can make him suffer? Suffer for anything he's put you through. Doesn't that sound better? That was always his one flaw. Obsessed with making me suffer, keeping me alive. It's because of that he's never truly won. I won't make the same mistake. Please, Doctor. Don't do this. You're better than this. Don't do this, Doctor. Don't. You can't kill him. It'll only cause more pain and suffering. You can't do this. You're the Doctor. You're better than this. You are a good person, not a cold-blooded killer. What happened to the saver we used to know? I do hope you're not thinking of using that, because if you do, you'll no longer have any right to to the name you've taken. Are you sure this is a good idea, Doctor? You're the man who abhors violence, after all. I know it's the Master, and I know he's gonna gone away too far, but... Obviously, you haven't seen my unit days. I've fired guns and snapped necks without any hesitation. Don't you Wait. dare underestimate me. Wait, the doctor was in a unit? He was in unit, but he was a scientific advisor. He never snapped necks. He did use Venusian Aikido, which utilized small movements to do maximum um knockout effects he didn't actually kill anybody intentionally and he never <laughs> guns oh cool so, uh, well this is a different doctor different universe i guess i don't know <sighs> doc how the hell can you use a gun with a finger trigger by being brilliant <laughs> How does Sexy feel about what you're going to do? Anata, try to stop the doctor! This can't possibly end well! What the, why did you stop flying? <laughs> you damn well better listen to me right now, or I leave you to rot in a forgotten nebula. Stop being a piece of junk. Okay. <laughs> do you think you can really do it? Oh, yeah. Don't hesitate, Doctor. I know that deep down you hate the idea, but the Master has gotten out of control. All it takes is a quick pull of the trigger, and you're done. Alonzi, Doctor! It's time. Doctor, what would you do if you saw the master going out with Octavia? Oh my. <laughs> you missed, coward. Who are you? Well, I think the master is mad. No? Oh, oh my. <laughs> but then I well.
<laughs> it's only just beginning, Doctor.